Today I'm going to be talking about, actually finishing off, I should say. Today I'm going to be finishing off the album reviews of Steely Dan um, with their sixth album, Asia. A, I think that's how it's pronounced. A J A. Asia, I think. Um, Asia. So, um, it is a jazz rock, yacht rock and pop rock album which was released on September of 1977 um, I've done album reviews before I by other bands that had you know the style was yacht rock, yacht rock. Um, so if you don't mind people that you know if you know what style that kind of music is comment down the, the down below um, I can't remember what band it was that had that different solo on that album, but I'm not quite sure exactly what kind of style that is, you know, but um, anyways, um, like I said, it was released on September of 1977, so on this album, Michael McDonald from the Dewey Brothers and Timothy B. Sh uh, Schmidt um, are on backing vocals, so Timothy B. Schmidt, um, I don't know if he, he might have been still with, uh, Poco, that band, um, I think he was actually, I think he was, he might have joined the Eagles in, I know 79, the long run, he was on that album, he might have joined them around, say, 78, or whatever, around that time, almost 79, anyways, yeah, so, they're on back in vocals, um, so the songs on the album includes Black Cow, the 7 minute and 57 second song, Asia, the 7 minute and 33 second song, Deacon Blues, Peg, Home at Last, I Got the News, and last is Josie. Um, so there's only seven songs on this album. Um, so man, it, you know, it starts off with two long songs, like, well, yeah, I should say the first song is the, 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 the second and third song is a long, long, you know, long songs, like seven minutes and 57, so pretty much eight, eight minutes, um, long. And the other one's 733. Um, so yeah, this, you know, this is the last one I'm doing. Because I, uh, I don't have the album um, from, because the next album they had out was from 80, 1980. Um, so I don't, don't have that album. And I think they had one out in sometime in the 90s and in 2000s. Um, three more, I think, after this. Um, which, I would have to say, um, those albums I don't have. Um, so I can't really do album reviews of those. Um, so I'm not really familiar with those, those albums. Um, only the ones that I've done so far. Um, like this is the last one. Um, so I go through the songs again, there's Black Cow, the 7 minute and 57 second song, Asia, 7 minute and 33 second song, Deacon Blues, Hag, Home at Last, I Got the News, and last is Josie. Um, make sure to check out Steely Dan Can't Buy a Thrill album review. Steely Dan Countdown to Ecstasy album review. Steely Dan uh, Pretzel Logic album review. Steely Dan Katie Lloyd album review. And Steely Dan The Royal Scam album review. I'm all on my channel. Um, so hit that thumbs up, make sure to subscribe, and um, thank you so much for watching, um, and i got to say again, I gotta, like every time, if it wasn't 
for all you people that did subscribe to my channel, liking everything and so on. Um, like, and, you know, the album views that I've done, and lately, you know, the uh, uh, wrestling, um, wrestling movie, you know, the reviews that I've done as well for any wrestling fan out there, I've done a couple of them. So I'm going to do more, start kind of, you know, do more of them. So I've done one today. Um, make sure to check that one out, Hapoto. Which I would have to say, growing up, um, oh man, I had so many great favorite wrestlers growing up. Um, Bret Hart, you know, definitely is, you know, like, man, a legend. Um, so i done one on him, a, a video that I have on, video of him on DVD. So make sure to check that one out um, for any wrestling fan out there. Um, and yeah, I guess again, thank you so much, all you people subscribing and that. Hit the thumbs up, and um, thank you so much for watching this, the last one. I'm not sure exactly what band I'm going to get into next, but, um, most likely, most likely, probably like it. Some rock band, probably from the 70s, 80s, 70s, or 80s. So thank you very much for watching, and uh, bye.